Yo, what's going on guys? Prevised here. Welcome to another Roblox scripting tutorial. So what I'm going to be making is a potion, which once you touch a block, it it slowly kills you. So that's what I'm going to be doing. So let's, okay, why am, why, why am I testing? Okay. So first off, go to the view tab, press on explorer and properties. Uh, I'm going to open up output just for, just for me. You don't have to do it. All right, so let's insert a part inside the part. Right click, insert object, script. Okay, let me zoom in on this. All right, first off, we want to make a function script parent dot touched connect. I, I type bad. Hey, you can talk if you want. Also. I was like, Trimmer. I was waiting for like, when you to tell me when I was... <laughs> yeah, shout out to <laughs> Tremor like Gaming. Alright, I want to shout out to Tremor Gaming. Check out his channel, I'll leave a link in the description. I haven't yeah. uploaded in like a, mo a month. I'll have All to right. upload today. <laughs> so, if you want to be, also to you viewers, if you want to be in a YouTube video with me, you know, comment in the description. Yeah, so, what we just did is, script I'm out here to touch. So, <laughs> uh-huh. So we made a touched okay. function. So once we touch, then we want code to happen. So what this hit is, also by the way, caps do matter. So you can't have a capital S. I don't think. I don't think a capital S would work. Uh, lowercase P. I do not think that would work. Make sure that's capital. I had so, to learn the hard. <laughs> so let me just explain what script that parent that touch means. So. So we're inside a script, okay? We're inside the script. So script dot parent. The parent is part. So now, in, there's a function called touch inside of the part. So once you touch it, then code happens here. So that's what that means. So also instead of doing script dot parent, you could do game dot workspace. So which is, you see how in workspace, all this stuff is inside. So this is all children of workspace pretty much. So you know you don't see game anywhere. So where does game come from? Well all this stuff is in game. Just like how all this stuff is inside of workspace. So we're inside a game. Then we go into workspace. And then after workspace then we go to part. So there's something called part. Dot touch. So yep that's the same thing as script that parent pretty much. Just wanted to let you guys know. So let's just do script dot parent. Script dot parent dot touched. So what the hit means is whatever touches the part, like if it's a leg, if it's a left leg, for example, then code happens. So if your leg, left leg, touches the part, then code happens to the left leg. You know what I'm saying? Hope I explained like good enough. Okay. Huh? Pretty simple. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, so once we touch, then we want to find if it's a human that touches it. So if hit, oh, type so bad. Hit dot parent. Dang, can't type. Wait for child. Humanoid. Humanoid. Okay. Thin. Okay, so this line of code is if hit dot parent which is just say it was the left leg that touches the part if dot if hit dot parent if I cannot explain so if the leg part the left leg yes ma'am if the leg flags parent which is the what this is is the character and then it goes into the humanoid so that's what it's yeah that's what it is Dude, I cannot talk. I am sweating right now, dude. I am sweating. <laughs> oh my god, it's so hot in my room. So that's checking if whatever touches the part is humanoid. It, I mean, if it has a humanoid. Oh my god. <laughs> humanoid. <laughs> okay. Whatever. Humanoid, human, character, uh, same thing. So let's make a variable called hum, which is going to stand for humanoid. So hit.parent. <sighs> Wait for child. I need to start typing slow because I cannot type. Humanoid. 
So we made a variable called hum, which stands for humanoid. So hum is going to stand for humanoid. Okay. So let's make a while true do loop. So this is going to be a loop right here. So let's do. Let's change the walk speed of the character. So if the if a character touches it, if if the character touches the part, <laughs> then we want the walk speed of the character to change. And the normal walk speed for a character is 16. So I'm going to be doing half of 16, which is 8. You can do whatever you want. 3 also, 5 9 21. Huh? <laughs> Let's do 3 5 eight. 9 21. <laughs> Uh, I don't get it. <laughs> three, five. Like which, wh whichever nine. one you want to do. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Do whatever you want. You can make the. You no, know, you could do twenty-one if you want it to go faster. <laughs> you know what I'm saying. You have a potion. You have eight. Or you could just do nine plus ten. You could just do that. Twenty-one. Which is twenty-one. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> All right, Perfect. whatever. Ten. My bad. Eight. Okay. It's the most beautiful thing in the world. Which they have helmets on the head. 19, they got to run alone. Okay, hum dot health. So now we want to do hum dot health again equals minus one. Minus one. Don't put the equal sign after. Okay. So now what we're doing, we want to change the health of the character to the health of the character, but minus one. Also, because you do always need to die. Wait. Point one. You can change, you can change, okay, the only things I want y'all to change up in the script is this number, this, and this. So, anything for the sake blue. of the, this anything video, light blue. yeah, anything the, the blue, which is a number value. Okay, now that should work. Guys, I'm so sorry if I'm stuttering in this video. It's just I'm really hot and I cannot think. Alright. Alrighty, guys. So let's see what's about to happen. So you see I'm walking 16 speed. Look at this. I'm walking slowly. Oh, and look, look, check out my health. Look look at it. Look look how slow it's going down. Slowly dying. Oh my god, I died. Oh my god. I'm dead. Perfect. Yeah. It works. And if you also touch it like more, if you touch it more, your health is gonna go down It'll faster. Go faster. So it's kind of like a, just, a potion, just, pretty much. Just stand on it. So we could just name this, like, ki Killing Potion. And, you know, you can design the brick, put detail to it, whatever you want. Alright, well... So I'll make something out of this when I when I get to building. I'll show him it later. Do what? Maybe maybe he'll make it a thumbnail. <laughs> what? Nothing. I'm gonna build, I'm gonna build with that later. Alright. Well... Thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe. Thank you very much.